Hey guys, so I figured I should do a little bit of a Google Stadia review for you. So as part of this, I should I should let you know that I tested it in two different scenarios. One over a wireless Ethernet connection, and then the other one is over a wired connection. As part of the wired one, I had a 49 megabit per second download speed. And as part of their as part of their demonstration that would that try to explain how how amazing Stadia was over this wired wired or wireless connection, they stated that 35, 35 megabits per second was all you needed in order to get 4K video, 60 frames a second, and 5.1 surround. Now, as part of the Founders Pack, you get two free games, Samurai Showdown and Destiny 2 The Collection. I tried over both of those games. And I tried in a regular PE surrounding in Destiny 2. I originally tried in, in the Strike, uh, Shatter, no, not the Shatter Throne, but the, the Scarlet Keep Strike, Destiny 2. And I tried in the campaign mode of Samurai Showdown. Both PvE scenarios less startling or difficult than a PvP scenario. Now, as far as the lag times are concerned, one thing I saw in both games was a 2-3 to three second delay. And I didn't say millisecond, I said a full second three full seconds in between when I would start or stop an action and when that would that would inevitably take place in the game itself. Uh, the most startling thing I saw was when I was playing Samurai Showdown or attempting to anyway and I would fully teleport across the screen. That should not take place when I, I am expecting actually a decent when I'm expecting a decent connection all, all that being said I'm I'm supposed to be part of the target demographic for this amazing thing that Google tried to put out there and I saw none of that a lot of the reviews you've been seeing from Kotaku and Forbes and Tom's Hardware, CNET, wh wherever you get your reviews from, they are spot on. This thing did not meet my expectations at all. I've been part of the team hyping up this amazing thing the last few months. And it, it, put it bluntly, it's been a shit show. That, that's all I can really say. Um, I'm, I'm glad I got a controller and a Chromecast for 130 bucks, but I, I guess a game license out of it. But like, as far as whether or not it's actually going to be able to compete with current generation consoles, let alone next generation, laughable. That's really all I can say. So hopefully you guys have a better a, a better setup than I do, but that's really all I can say. Um, have a great rest of your day, and hopefully you guys are able to enjoy the, the free one when that, that launches. So later. I